<laughs> Welcome family and friends. I am going to do a Valentine's wreath and my daughter asked me a question which was absolutely fabulous and she had a wonderful idea. She said, do we always have to make them out of the ribbons? And I said, no. And she said, well, can we do something that would be more cost effective where we're not having to make a new wreath every single time? Can we show people how to use the same wreath and repurpose and redecorate it for each of the seasons or each of the holidays. And I thought that was a fabulous idea. So, fabulous. I have, <laughs> I did get two, <laughs> they're back behind the camera making fun of me. Anyhow, so I did get two basic wreaths. I have a uh, boxwood wreath that is an artificial wreath I was looking at the real ones, but the coloring will run when they get any moisture on them and they will um, deteriorate uh, over time. So I thought, well, we'll go with the plastic boxwood, which doesn't look too bad. And you'll see that in the next video for St. Patrick's Day. But today we're gonna do Valentine's and I have a grapevine wreath. So between the two, I think I'll be able to change them out and make it really interesting. Well, I found this X's and O at the dollar store, and I don't care for the heart, but I wanted the X's and O's. So I took my little Cricut scraper and worked loose, worked <laughs> loose the glue <laughs> to remove the X's and O's. So that took care of that. Now what I'm gonna do is I have these picks also from the dollar store and they have a clamp on the end of it. I don't know if you can see that. Let me get in on that. So there's clip. This little plastic <laughs> or little metal clip can actually come off. You just pull it off. And now you can separate your pieces, which is what I did with this one. So now I have three separate little hearts that I can use with glitter, chunky glitter, and this is with the fine glitter. So I also have this pink tool and I'm going to use the tool as a base. <laughs> this is what she's going to do. Oh. There we go. She looks really valentine today. There we go. Yeah. Oh, so <laughs> hugs and kisses to all of you. Mwah, mwah. <laughs> Anyhow, I'm going to use this as a base and I'm going to zip tie it onto the wreath. And I doubled it. And then I'm just going to take little sections and I'm going to come around and zip tie it on here. And that way I can cut these off when Valentine's Day is over and we'll use the wreath for another, the grapevine for another wreath. So I'm just going to bunch it up and zip tie it to one of the branches. I don't know if you can see what it is I'm doing with my fingers. So I'm grabbing up the netting and I'm going to scrunch it up, take my zip tie, go through a branch and then tighten it up and I'm pulling them all to the outside because I will be trimming these off. But it gives a nice base. And that way I'm not gluing anything directly onto the grapevine, which
And I just got these, um, both wreaths. I got them off of Amazon. to loop this one. So what I want to do is I'm going to loop this one back onto itself and zip tie it. So let's see how do I want to do that? There we go. So you have no raw edges sticking out. So let me cut off these. Those go in the trash. So now I've got my wreath with its netting. Now I need to figure out, I wanted this to be kind of a focal piece. Gonna come give me your opinion? Sure. Good. I love when we do these together. And then we could work these in. Or we could put this up over here. do that cock eyed ring now you lose it she could do this but she it's yeah, too it disappears mm -hmm. well what if you just did these three with this you like that? Because these are this is the same as this. That's a little different, you know? Mm-hmm. What do you think? Let's check it out. This little bow here. Yeah. I think it's cute. Nice and simple. But there's a distinct between these two now. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like the, this blends in too much. Kind of just faded. <laughs> <laughs> it sprouted. It sprouted. Oh, I think that's cute. think of this can you turn it around so the whole world can see <laughs> I don't have anything attached down yet that looks I think cute. It's cute so here's our simple Valentine's wreath so happy Valentine's Day everybody happy Valentine's, happy Valentine's Day. Day and make it a Gorgeous, Gorgeous day, day every day. day. Bye. Bye.